What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Childish. We are back at it again with that next Man Crush Monday. Boom. Got him. Here we go. Uh, Y'all know what it is. Once a week, Man Crush Monday. It's our one and only time to go ahead and showcase a variety of Twitch channels, YouTube channels, and or websites uh, in an effort to promote them and help them grow as there's a lot of great people out there that are providing uh, better content than me, right? (laughs) <laughs> but uh uh that you know they're not known you know they are uh considered the the quiet people or the they're 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 the dark horses right some some more dark horses so we got we got ourselves today the uh quiet guardian uh foros nine so foros nine i think that's how you pronounce it it's nice nay we're just gonna say foros all right foros is uh, uh for those of you uh, obviously that are watching this series that are um, you know, hanging around in the uh, top 100 ranks, you've seen him, you know, quite a bit. Um, he's one of the top members in the guild Proc Ready, um, and the channel is called Proc Ready Gaming. So, um, as you guys know, uh, I, I generally make these videos to, you know, showcase the channel. But there's there's really only one reason why I bring this. This is one of the reasons why sometimes we'll go, you know, a week or two without, you know, having a Man Crush Monday or, or something to chat about here. And, and what is that reason? Why, why do we go ahead and, and uh, why do we do that? Uh, because uh, w- with regards to these Man Crush Mondays, you know, there's a lot of people out there providing content. But, you know, we got a lot of similarities and whatnot. And, and, and some of the people that are currently in the top, you know, consider the top three uh, YouTubers out there. I don't need to repeat that. You know who they are. Um, they all do something a little bit different from other people that makes that separates them from the rest. And for Foros... Um, he's been making videos for quite some time. If anyone is like me, that's been following him since he's had like 25 subs, you know, he generally has been making videos. And even though like a lot of people that started, you know, at the beginning of this year, or like, you know, uh, February, March or whatever like that, you know, he, he made those videos. He didn't get a lot of, you know, feedback or views from them, but he continued to make those videos. He was persistent about it. He kept on doing it. He he realized that even though he might only get 12 views on a video after two days, he understood that 12 views, that's 12 people that got, you know, some education, some entertainment, and, you know, was looking, looking to come back for more. And so, you know, I'm, I'm super excited to say that after, uh, I think three months, um, you know, he went from 25 uh, subscribers to almost 600 subscribers now. And I believe that his recent uh, um, climb has been basically from two main groups or two main uh, styles of video. So about a month ago, uh, about a month or a month and a half ago, he started incorporating uh, Summoner's War uh, TOA hard videos. So as you guys know, um, anybody that's in the mid to late stages of the game, they've kind of cleared. They've cleared Giants B10. They've cleared Dragons B10. They've cleared TOA normal. And really all there is for them is now Guild Wars and TOA hard. Um, and of course, TOA hard, you know, it's, we're all about trying to get that second devil mon, that second light and dark scroll, that second, uh, legendary scroll. And so what, what, what's different than what people do out there right now, as you know, there's many, many people, uh, both, uh, on all, actually all, all over the, all over the world, um, that are top players on the global and Asia server that, you know, make TOA hard videos, but, you know, they basically just make, uh, the, you know, the gaming videos, um, with, you know, regular sound or a little bit of music. There's really no explanation, no rhyme or rhythm to why they do it, no method to their madness. And um, he started incorporating that in some of his videos, which is really, really good. Um, you know, this is that's that's kind of where we're at. That's kind of the the trend right now. People are clearing TOA normal, and people want to do TOA hard. And now people are looking for videos every month showcasing the the new lineup that Comptos brings us with the TOA hard, and try to see you know how do we people go about it, and and what what kind of unique units are doing it. Okay. There's some people out there that are, you know, you know, using, you know, very, you know, tankyish units. There's some people out there that are bringing just a round of five CC units, getting the job done. It's it's very unique, and he has himself a nice handful of units to mix it up and showcase you a wide variety of good content. Okay, but that's not even that's not even the gist of it. What really caught my eye, because again, a lot of people are making TOA hard videos. What really caught my eye is something that he's doing that. Um, Again, if, if anything, uh, I don't know about their channel, but a, a lot of few people are doing it now. Um, he realizes that he is a Guardian 2, Guardian 3 player, and he has the opportunity to, um, you know, play a lot of the top players that you see in my Educate Nominate videos or you see in the top 100, you know, all the time. 
and he decided to uh, start a new series called uh, Summoner's War Top Level Arena Defenses. So what he's basically doing is very similar to my uh, subscriber showcase where I find people in the arena, um, you know, get ready to attack them. But we talk about their pros and their cons of their defense um, or, you know, what we would do to kind of change it out. Um, he basically at his level, he just showcases their units and, you know, shows you how they synergize with one another. And then he obviously takes a, a particular team to go ahead and see if he can counter it. Sometimes he wins, sometimes he doesn't. But the cool thing about it is he shows, you know, all those videos and tries to, uh, you know, educate you on why people do what they do. Now, this is a controversial topic because a lot of the top players, you know, are not big fans of uh, having everybody and their mom, you know, see their typical teams. But the good thing about the top players is that you know, if they're attempting to, you know, get the job done with one team, then obviously uh, uh, they are mistaken because as you guys know, or as any other Guardian player, Guardian 2, Guardian 3, though, you have to constantly um, mix around your defense, you know, mix around some of these uh, runes in order to, you know, progressively stay at four. You know, your arena defense is only good, uh, is only good when the opposing team, uh, you know, as good as it can hold, right? Once the opposing team has it on farm mode, and has the opportunity to take it, then you have to think about, you know, a new plan, a new method um, to try to get the job done. There's people that constantly switch out runes throughout the week. There's people that constantly, um, you know, uh, mix out units and whatnot. So even though he's showcasing the, the top players and maybe maybe they don't want to see it or whatnot, the cool thing about it is uh, all he's trying to do is educate you guys on why he's, uh, on why these teams are, are really, really good and, and give you guys some just content, right? Some high Guardian 2, Guardian 3 player content. Um, we have a lot of Guardian uh, players that showcase their their stuff on the Twitch, but we don't have a lot of Guardian 2, Guardian 3 players that are consistently uh, making videos in the top ranks on YouTube. So I'm super excited for you guys to check that out. Uh, definitely some of his biggest uh, videos, a um, couple of these two videos that he just recently put out um, have you know, basically about 3,000 views, you know, after a couple of days. So um, a, a big, big jump compared to some of his other videos. So I'm looking forward to seeing uh, how his channel grows in the future. Definitely, uh, you know, get out there, guys. Check out his channel. It's in the uh, YouTube description down below. And so definitely go ahead and sub to him. Check it out and, you know, give him some feedback as far as what you want to see because he has the opportunity to showcase a wide variety of units and, 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 and go up against some of the best of the best. So... Um, we'll go ahead and cut it off right there. Thank you, uh, Proc Ready. Thank you, Foros, for uh, taking the time to make these videos. In addition, uh, thank you for uh, you know sticking to your word and, and and getting out there making those videos despite not having you know a lot of views. Um, I, for one, can attest as you know after uh, almost one year and five thousand uh, you know subscribers or close to five thousand subscribers, um, things have always been uh, very very slow with 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 respect to. You know some of the top three youtubers out there um some even have started you know months past me and have done really really well uh, the fact of the matter is that regardless if you have 500 subscribers 5,000 subscribers or some of them out there having 30,000 subscribers you're you're doing what you got to do to uh provide content for the community and regardless if it's you know one person or, or, or a thousand um we appreciate your support and thank you for doing everything that you do so again guys Thank you all for tuning in. It's been a pleasure to make these videos for you. As always, it's your boy Childish or Childish Plays. Check it out. Boom. Take care. We'll see you next time, guys. We're out.